Okay, I'm going to show you how to create a company file. When you first come into account right from MIAB, you get to this thing here. Obviously, I want to create a new file. Here it is. Um, which one are you using? That's important. I'm using the standard one. I'm in Australia. That's easy. Go to the next one. The company name. Just put in the name of the um, the, the exercise that you're doing. Uh, the one I'm going to do is called Hogarth's uh, Gardens. Um, that's an important thing. Don't have to worry about anything, any other details. Go to Next. Just use this financial year. It doesn't matter. Accounts List option. I want you guys to build your own list. And I'm going to show you how to create new accounts in a moment. Um, the create the company file. Um, it doesn't allow you to change it. Unfortunately, just keep it in my library where it is saved on your computer. We then go to create company file. It'll do some work. And it comes up with this. I want you to go to the Easy Setup Assistant. And what we're going to be doing, we're going to use this company for practice, that's what we're doing, but we've got 30 days in order to do it. I'm, I don't think you're going to take more than 30 days to complete the, complete the exercise. So I'm going to click on that and go to Next. It tells you some information, that's fine, and we're ready to go. What I want you to do is to click on Accounts and go to Account List. Now you notice that there's a number that automatically have been set up for us, some of which we'll be able to use, most of which we're not, but uh, we can't actually change those. This is our um, chart of accounts. As you can see, the assets are 1, liabilities 2, equity, owners equity 3, income, cost of sales, expenses, other expenses, and so on. Okay. I'm going to now start the exercise. In this exercise, they started the business with $10,000 in a check account. That's a normal um, cash at bank. I'm going to edit that, or I could have gone to open balances there. Um, it's all there. I'm going to put in um, $10,000. Type it in. OK. Now what you'll notice uh, later on when we look at the opening balances, um, that check account's $10,000, um, equity um, hasn't come up yet, but when we look at later on the balance sheet, we'll find that it's 10000 as well. Now I'm going to show you how to put in a new account. So just go to new, funnily enough. But the, the type of account that I want to put in is an asset, and it's called Equipment $5,000. So what I need to do is to look at the um, chart of accounts list here. Um, I might choose to use 818000. I'll show you what that means. So new account type, in this case it's a fixed asset, I'm going to type the new number, every account's got to have a discrete number, I'm going to type in the new account, it hasn't got, it, it's got an opening balance of $5,000, that's what the owner put in, and now I'm ready to go. So once you've done this, you finished, you close it, um, and then for the other accounts, I beg your pardon, now we're ready to um, put in the transactions. So you go to um, accounts, no, that's wrong, I beg your pardon. We go close this, we go to accounts and record journal entry, and that'll be the next um, session that I'll do with you.